Hello and welcome to Newsbreak. I'm your host, Alex Snyder. Coming up, Class 3A All District 4 team announced. But first, today's top stories. A van from Keokuk County jumped the curb, struck a light post, and collided with Taste of China's front door in Washington around noon. Emergency responders and onlookers gathered at the scene moments after the crash, which caused significant noise. One individual was placed on a stretcher and transported via a Washington County ambulance at approximately 12.15 p.m. Fortunately, there were no additional injuries reported. The number of people inside Taste of China at the time remains uncertain. According to one witness, the driver stated that they had hit the gas instead of the brakes. The Washington County owned lot at 302 West Madison Street is going up for sale again with a minimum bid of $15,000 as county supervisors aim to recoup some of the approximately $70,000 spent on the property's acquisition, house demolition, and basement filling. The decision to resell the lot passed with a 4-1 vote. The county plans to accept bids in early 2024 after adhering to standard procedures. We're going to take a quick break and when we come back, we'll take a look at your weather. At the Capper Auto Group, we put our customers' needs first and understand that everyone is as different as the vehicle they select. We offer new Ford, Chevrolet, Buick, GMC, Jeep, Chrysler, Dodge, and Ram vehicles in a friendly environment that puts you in the driver's seat. When it comes to service, we maintain factory trained technicians and competitive pricing. The Capper Auto Group still believes that service after the sale provides the best customer experience. Come see the Capper experience for yourself. You know, it's not a question of what all you have and so on with your life. It's who is in your life and how much you care for them and how much they care for you. And Tammy definitely cares. Federation Bank is a locally owned bank providing award-winning customer service. We believe that we are more than just a federation of banks, but a federation of communities serving Brighton, Richland, Wellman, and Washington, Iowa. Federation Bank's highly skilled staff is here to make sure you are able to accomplish your personal and professional goals, whatever they may be. Federation Bank, your family bank. I met Tammy about 20 years ago with, when her daughter was in Special Olympics and I was coaching. She told me that she was into doing senior benefits. We became even closer friends. She cares about everybody, especially the seniors. So call Hello, welcome to Newsbreak. Coming up, your five-day forecast, but first, obituaries. Joe Blaine of Fairfield passed away on November 2nd at the age of 66. A visitation will be held November 10th from 2 to 4 p.m. at Benner Funeral Home. Bertha Ann Yelly Pickle of New London passed away on November 6 at the age of 92. Visitation will be held from 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. November 9th at Elliott Chapel, New London. That was your obituaries. Now it's time for your five-day forecast. Today it will be partly cloudy with a high of 62. Wednesday carries a slight chance of showers with a high of 64. On Thursday, expect mostly sunny skies. The high will be 53 degrees. Friday will be mostly sunny. The high will be 51. Wrapping up the forecast, Saturday will be partly cloudy. The high will be 50 degrees. We're going to take another quick break, and when we come back, we'll take a look at your sports. In the heart of rural Iowa, where community matters most, the connections we make are made to last. Meet KCTC, your hometown internet, phone, and TV provider. At KCTC, we're not just about technology, we're about people. Our dedicated team are your neighbors, committed to bringing you top-tier services right where you live. We believe in giving back to the community that raised us. Experience the power of a real connection with KCTC. Join us in building a stronger, more connected Southeast Iowa. Family owned and operated by Andy and Sarah Ross, Ross Auto has been your vehicle repair and maintenance headquarters since 1935. We specialize in all makes of cars and light duty trucks. 
With our variety of available services, let us help you keep rolling and your vehicle operating efficiently. Services include general auto repair, alignments, brakes, fuel injection, and more. Schedule your appointment today at 319-653-5656. That's 319-653-5656. Welcome back to Newsbreak. I'm your host, Alex Snyder. It's now time for your sports. The Class 3A District 4 All-District Team for the 2023 high school football season was recently revealed. Despite the district's competitiveness, Washington and Mount Pleasant each had several players included. However, the first team selections were dominated by Mount Pleasant and Assumption. Winfield Mount Union football is gearing up for a significant showdown as they enter the eight-player semifinals at UNI Dome in Cedar Falls. Their opponent Bishop Garrigan and a win here would propel the Wolves to the state championship. Winfield Mount Union boasts an impeccable 11-0 record and holds the number one seed in the tournament, while Bishop Garrigan comes in at number four seed. Winfield Mount Union and Bishop Garrigan will clash at 10 a.m. on Wednesday. That was your news for Southeast Iowa. I've been your host Alex Snyder. This has been your news break and I will see you next time.